All right, people, what's up, everyone, and welcome to another reaction video for another Hugby's How It's Actually Made video, and this one is for Coffee, which is a pretty recent one. I think it's the second most recent one, and I've been meaning to watch this one for the longest time, but I never got around to it until today. And this is one of his longest ones, too. Damn, over 10 minutes if you count the uh, sponsor, uh, which I love. I have sponsor blocker. Not because I want to block these ads, it's just because, uh, or sponsors, sponsor ads, you know what I mean? Um, it, it tells me exactly when the sponsor happens, so they can't, they can't sneak up on you, I know, I know. I've had, I actually have had it off for like, like a couple months at this point, so, uh, you know, shout outs to all the people that have sponsors. You, you guys have made it very entertaining to hear your sponsors, including Hugby. So, link in the description, um, oh, I guess it's Manscaped too, spoilers um so link in the description go check it out yourself uh sorry for the text that's just what's gonna happen because of uh the footage he uses it, it blocks worldwide and blocks in several ter territories and stuff so i gotta do that or it'll be blocked and never america but every like almost everywhere else <laughs> so anyway let's go three two one and play according to legend a goat herder in ethiopia discovered coffee around 850 a.d eventually trying to the beverage reached italy where the first European oh, coffee house opened in 1645. Today, about different. 2 billion cups of coffee are drunk each day around the world, making coffee the second most valuable trading commodity after oil. Coffee boasts over 800 flavor characteristics and features enough caffeine to kill a full-grown elephant. <laughs> Brewing up a cup from coffee beans is very similar to cultivating someone's personality. The longer and more intensely they're roasted, the darker the outcome will be. Espresso, a concentrated <laughs> brew of coffee, gets its name from the words express Damn, and this disco is a really long due intro. to its popularity in nightclubs during the 1970s. Oh. In the modern world, Coffee is regularly consumed in every single oh industrialized God. country, except Gerblazistan, because I just made that one up. <laughs> this episode is brought to you by Manscaped.com. I feel every like morning routine doesn't just involve a fresh cup of coffee. But I feel a like that was the longest intro I've ever seen. Well. That's oh, why hey. Manscaped is trusted by more than four million men. Those clean, smooth fuckers, not these guys. Oh, sorry. The yeah, you grooming. stay fucking there. Manscaped Don't even is come near it. the ultra premium collection with a two-in-one shampoo conditioner. Body what? wash, hydrating body spray, aluminum free deodorant, I finally look and normal? lip balm. Oh, I need that. And it's waterproof. Whoa! Manscaped there also is. offers a peak hygiene plan that will replenish your supply of Manscaped products video? on a regular cycle by shipping I mean, I've, right I've seen him before. I've actually joined, before. I've actually joined a couple of his live streams free, in the past. Even if you're international, but only if you use code HUGBEES. Speaking code of Hugbees, lip balm. you'll also get 20% off your first order. That's 20% off your first order, plus free international shipping, with promo code HUGBEES at manscaped.com. Coffee's flavor depends on where it grows and how elaborately decorated its bag is. <laughs> right. Uh, so those are those are boring ones. So they taste like shit. I see. Here in Costa Rica, coffee beans are hidden from the municipal government, so local farmers can export them without having ninety percent of their profits confiscated. I don't know if that's a joke or if that's true. <laughs> it's a sad world we live in, where I don't even know if that's a joke or not. I'm gonna assume that's real. It sounds this sad is to be coffee. Enough. That's it? No, that's a plant. Don't lie to me. You can't hide the truth. Coffee takes about three days to flower and three nights to grow into red cherries that contain the coffee bean. You're lying to me. The local mayor of Costa Rica harvests the red cherries after having disposed of the farmer and his family. <laughs> Oh, this is Mayor? All right. Well, hey, at least the he gets his hands dirty in multiple different ways. collection unit for all cherries he picks. God, that must be heavy he has the girth and length to support the basket. Mm. The fingernail grind oh, adds no. to the flavor. Oh, is Wee Wee's in there? No. The Ew. baskets are emptied Gross into bags fucking. made from a combination of strengthened canvas and burlap. Perfect <laughs> for transporting cherries, beans, and bodies. <laughs> or for Fallout 76 uh, collector's editions. The mayor never skips leg day. I could tell they're veiny. I feel it. Whatever beans don't end up on the factory floor in this sloppy operation end <laughs> up in a collection tank. I feel like his voice is different. A in this mysterious one. Spanish employee named Pedro insisted on washing his oh. fingernail gunk off in the oh. same collection tank as the coffee plants. You gross fuck. The cherries travel via worm screw to a pulping machine. Oh, why is there cum in there? Pulping machine is just a politically correct term for 
giant mashing machine that squeezes the shit out of the cherries. <laughs> oh no, I squeezed the shit out of my cherry and that's why there's cum in there. It's so easy, even a factory worker can do oh, it. Oh, I hate it. I hate that. Stop it. Just don't squeeze my cherries, bro. The beans travel down a lazy river to two large sectors. <laughs> oh, I love Typically, the lazy river. Typically, the park enforces a policy of staying in your inner tube and no tube jumping. But everyone tube jumps. Everybody That's tube just jumps. That's just part of the fun. It. I just get out of the, the fucking tube. The paradox of the lazy river Fuck is it. most people aren't lazy in it. Most people like to fuck around and <laughs> throw shit all the time. You know what? Fuck this park. It sucks. <laughs> <laughs> the beans continue to soak in a combination of 50% water, 50% park guest fluids, until they... Oh, hey, it's Pedro again. <laughs> there he is. You know, on second uh, look, his mustache looks kind of fake. Yeah. That's a bit weird. Hey, fucker, the let me see. beans drop into a drying bin. Wait a minute, you're not Pedro, Workers you're the mayor. Workers lay out the beans in the shape of the American flag to pay tribute to the country that consumes the most coffee per person per year. The country that consumes the most coffee per person per year is actually Finland, but America is cooler, so let's just roll with it. Once the beans are patriotic God bless enough, us. they go into a milling machine. First, it's oh, red, milk, red and blue, which is located in a house. Red, the red. dried beans are empty onto Some the white. floor of the house with the mill. Locally, this is known as the Bart Simpson. Pedro's <laughs> father gives the beans no, a soft get. touch as well as a tender kiss. To let them know that everything will be okay. Why the fuck did he do that? He fucking put his lips on. I'm not drinking these, this the coffee. Beans are shaking fuck you. To piss them off and help them unlock their buried potential. <laughs> oh, like Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> unlock their buried potential. Yeah, it means about to go Super Saiyan. Which I'm about to go KO Ken times 10. You don't want to see While me go KO Ken times 10. The canvas and burlap bags from earlier with precisely 151.84828499999 pounds of coffee beans. Okay. Any more or less, and the entire factory will be shut down by the local <laughs> mayor. God damn, that's a fat bag. Mm, that's a fat bag of nuts. After being or filtered through whatever. a cage of starving refugees for cleaning, the coffee beans enter a <laughs> what roasting they, what machine. They, what do they do to Some clean it? Some viewers have probably noticed how similar chocolate Suck production is to coffee production. Don't no, worry, I didn't we've that. all noticed what a giant nerd you are. What? I'm not annoying. A factory worker looks at some beans. Uh, th that's the all beans they do. Close, ooh, contemplates ooh, life's ooh, futility. <laughs> and then looks at the beans again. Oh, wow, beans. This looks just like peanuts. The beans get the so hot they start to steam. Hence why in upstate New York, coffee is often known as steamed beans. The factory manager scoops out I some beans York. just to double check that, that they haven't disappeared steamed yet. Steamed beans? It's like As the beans steam roast, hams? they go from green to golden brown to decadent feces to black. <laughs> decadent feces. Coffee makers test out small batches before shipping out larger ones. Testing products before shipping them is a fairly radical concept, but coffee makers are pretty radical people. The beans are roasted, scooped, kerfloganized. <laughs> what? What are you doing to that poor bean? Oh, I crushed him up. Scooped again. Okay, yeah. And turned into four ridiculously large cups of coffee. <laughs> Hell yeah, man. Let's get fucked up. Or let's get... Whatever. Oh. A soothsayer Looks like... predicts the future of the coffee <laughs> through a tasting sayer. ritual. The tasting ritual begins with smelling the coffee's aroma to determine its success in dating, money, and family <laughs> affairs. Yeah, it looks like shit water. Then she skims the surface to predict oh. which prominent world leader will die next. <laughs> this process has a 99% accuracy rating. 99% of the time, it's completely wrong. Oh. She takes a sip Wait, for the taste test I look red. and spits it out. Oh, this oh. coffee backwash will be used to coat the beans before they're shipped no. to give them a mystical flavor. Stop, I don't want to see your spit out anymore. Please don't spit out. Don't. Oh, oh, Any fucking. rejected Ugh. coffee beans are sent to a heavy-duty grinder. This grinder powders the beans up and mixes them with potting soil to create fertilizer to sell to industrial farms. Oh, hell yeah. Grow the those coffee plants beans quick. don't help the plants grow any better, what? but Can't, it does what? make them energetic, yeah, irritable, like... and constantly need to piss. <laughs> Ugh. Pissy plant. The acceptable coffee beans move onto packaging. As each bag is sealed, nitrogen is pumped in to help prevent the coffee from going stale. 
It's often recommended to immediately huff this nitrogen upon opening the coffee bag to immediately capture its freshest aroma. Oh, yeah. If customers are unable to do this, coffee yeah, producers good. recommend purchasing a tank of nitrous oxide and wearing it while you sleep to enhance the flavor of your first cup of coffee in the morning. That seems like a good idea. I'm going to do that. I'm going to never drink this fucking coffee ever because the weird guy with the mustache kissed every bean. Fucker. Over at the espresso machine, I don't care if they watch the barista them. demonstrates the technique to create the perfect espresso. No, is it spitting oh, the fuck this out? This isn't really how coffee is made anymore. This is just how to make coffee. Does that count? Yeah. No. I guess technically it's how I mean, coffee is made, yeah, I, yeah, I but, so. it, but it's not. It's it's not how you produce uh, coffee or uh, make coffee the product. Looks like shit it's water. How you actually Stop. use Ew. the coffee that you purchase. But, okay, although you can also buy coffee from, like, a restaurant or, is that or how something. And I guess they do have to make the they coffee, make so it. this is how coffee is also made, I guess. I, yeah. Okay, th this is espresso, though. This espresso is made differently than regular coffee, and... Oh, fuck, I'm so confused. <laughs> Look, they're even using, they're using a French press now. This is just getting more complicated. Okay, you know what? Is how coffee is made and how to make coffee. I mean, I don't really know how to make coffee. They didn't really explain it, to be fair. But then that what would mean the that fuck? the initial process isn't how coffee is made, but how coffee is prepared? <laughs> fuck it. Coffee. Fuck it. It's made. It's made. The it's end. fucking made. Drink Stop it. Stop the video. Sluts. All right. Well, it's over. Is this a, how it... Yeah, it is. That, that time Satan made Spider-Man get to... <laughs> you know what? Don't even want to know. Anyway, all right, that, that was pretty good. I feel like that one maybe was maybe a little bit too long, if, if I want to be critical, man. Like, it, it was still funny. The tone was also just a little bit different, you know what I mean? Like, even the video games one had, like, that was after this one. So, maybe it's just because it's longer, there's not as many, like, really funny, like, bombs of humor. Uh, it was still really good, I really liked it. Uh, it went by quick. Um, but... Uh, if I want to be negative, you know, I'm, uh, man, I'm po posy vibes all the time. Every single time. Everybody knows this about me. I'm always positive. Always. You can't find one time where I'm not. Um, definitely never. <laughs> but, uh, uh, yeah. Anyway, there you go. That's how it's actually made coffee. We're still good. It's still good. I like it. I like it. Good job, buddy. I like it. I don't want to uh, fucking drink coffee anymore because it looks like fucking sludgy ass water. But, you know, hey, whatever. Uh, that's it. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you, Derek. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.